Many of the famous chapters in the history of the Tour de France have been written in the high mountains where the Tour winner is often found. But in the Netherlands, the country is flat. There are no mountains. The telling factor is always the wind and who can combat it the best. Rotterdam is very exposed to the wind because it's so close to the sea and there are no mountains, buildings, trees or landscape to protect us from the wind. Just like the other teams, we've tried to analyse this stage between Rotterdam and Brussels because it requires specific tactics. We must analyse this stage because it's very dangerous with the amount of wind that could be there. I think it will be a stage where there could be a lot of action and a lot can happen on a day like this. Therefore, it's important for us to assess where the wind will be, if it will be at the beginning of the stage, in the middle of the stage or at the end of the stage. You can see if the wind is from the west and then looking at the direction of the race, it's easy to see that there can be a lot of dangerous sections. And this part, for example, when the riders turn to the left and to the right, there are a lot of areas where the echelons can form. Echelons are when the riders go into a formation to the side of each other to work against the wind and the head of the peloton tries to go very fast to create an advantage. When this happens you have to take advantage by being in the first, second, third or fourth position and the last rider protected from the wind is virtually on the edge of the road but they are able to still get some protection but the ones behind they are not protected. So when you don't have a position in this front group you must open a new echelon to create your own protection from the wind. The problem is every rider wants to be in the first echelon, but with one or two teams controlling the front group, there isn't enough room for everyone to fit. So the riders in the back of the echelon, they have no chance. On a day like this, we won't find out who will win the tour, but we could find out who will not win the tour. So it's very important for each director sportif to work on this stage. We have put a lot of effort into preparing specifically for this day. But that is our job and it will be worth it.